Hey everybody, Carbases, we welcome. We're going to do the Essentials number 13 right now, uh, eBay style. Come this way, tis a half case. Alright, as we have done all night, I am going to go right hand side. later. <sighs> Sanchos, do you really want to make this hard for me too? Apparently you do. So I guess you will. All right, we have got Immaculate in the store. We have got Five Star in the store. Both, the, the, the next two closest cases of each one of those will go tonight. I want to open an Immaculate. I feel like I got a hot hand with Immaculate. So if anybody's floating like one way or the other on the on what to go with, Immaculate will be an easy crush. Five star. Well, I mean, I don't even. I'm not even gonna have to like worry myself on five star because five star is hot. It's baseball. It's hot. It's good. Knobs, barrels. I mean, the, the, the stuff is amazeballs, man. It's amazeballs. So we do... Okay, so I, I think this is like how, how we finish out this night. Okay? We do two five-star breaks, three immaculates, Four gold labels and that Onyx baseball. Why doesn't anybody want to get into the uh, Onyx autograph baseball business? They only made 30 cases of that stuff. It is pure T fire. I got like seven spots left to, to, to crack open a whole case on a random. You're guaranteed autograph ball. Guaranteed. RipCityCards.com. Just go, I mean, just go, just go get it. It's, it's, it's going to be good, man. And it's, I mean, it's an autograph baseball. It's not a jersey. It's easy. It's easy to handle. Easy to keep. Yeah. I think essentials is traditionally easier to open. Okay, all right. So listen, I mean, listen, you guys are gonna have to kind of slow the chat down just a little bit because um, I'm having I'm having a hard time keeping up with uh, all of the chatter. So I mean, maybe you guys only uh, put up like the most important things that you have to say. Not you know, you know, not a lot of like the, the you know the weird crazy stuff. And since we are planning on breaking. Board tonight. You know what I'm saying? You know, it's, 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 I, I, I need I need to be able to stay focused on what on what's important for breaking, not just uh, you know how your grandma's doing and stuff. Although I do want to know how your grandma's doing. Legit want to know. You know, but just you know maybe send me a DM on that one on, on how Grams is doing. 
otherwise, you know, in open chat, you know, let's just talk about so how, how we're going to, you know, cr crush through this kind of stuff. Giants and Phoenix and D-backs and Golden. Ooh. Eric, I mean, I, I could not have picked uh, finer choices for you, I don't think. Really don't think I could have picked finer choices. Essentials is our last one. Listen, the teams don't matter. I mean, if the quality business is there. Oh, hang on. Sorry, I need one quick second. All right. You guys can just uh, suck it. That was uh, my mom. She uh, was on a trip from New England back to, uh, like, let's just call it Orlando, and I had to make sure that she was okay. So. If you got a problem with it, if you got a problem with me loving my mom, then uh, you know you can just uh, ask my D. You know what I'm saying? That sounds like sounds like she had a good time. It's kind of weird, like, her cousin was, like, a, a pilot in uh, Vietnam, right? So, she, like, her, 
the cousins wife and him would go to like these like reunions that the like his I don't know, squadron or whatever the hell you call it would have. He died like two years ago. But the wife still goes to the reunions. And like the wife has invited my mom like to go just like for shits or giggles or whatever. So she's she went to Seattle last year and went to like Martha's Vineyard. Like this year. Uh, Kids Play for Life. I have not looked since about 5 o'clock. But, I mean, honestly, email is something that I do, like, before breaking and then after breaking. So, like, I mean, when, like, when breaking is done, I will definitely, uh, see what's up. I mean, unless it is, like, something that is, like, super, super important, I, then I will, I will look, uh, you know, look now. But Andrew, how are you doing? It has been it's been a while since I've uh, had the pleasure of talking to you. All right, so we got the uh, Juwan Evans rookie card, Dotson rookie. Insert a Deer and Fox red rookie. Mm. All the reds together. JJ Reddick to uh, 99. Let's put that one by itself. Jeremy Lynn. All right. I think we've got this all about squared up. Hey, Terrence Ferguson. Autographed 99 for the uh, Thunder. Uh, Andrew, man, nothing. Really, I mean, it is same deal. You know, just different day. I've got uh, this, you know, hanging out with me uh, all day, every day. Which I just could not be uh, happier about. Indispensable rookie Dennis Smith Jr. No, not numbered. No, well, Eric, that's. I apologize, Eric, but that's not going to happen uh, because I will be winning the Mega Millions. A Josh Hart, 25, rookie autograph. And uh, I'm going to buy Panini with my Mega Millions. And uh, make them change the uh, tear top on their, uh, on, their, on their packs. It's the only thing I'm going to do with the money. The wife's probably going to be like, why don't we buy, like, you know, a house and, uh, you know, you know, save for like the kids, you know, you know, future and stuff. And I'd be like, no, uh -uh, no, we're gonna spend every single dollar that we have on Panini, the Milos, and we're gonna just do nothing but change the uh, but, but change the pack rip on it 
That's it. That's all we're gonna. That's all we're gonna change. They can do whatever else they want to, but we're gonna make it so that you can easily tear a pack of cards. To me, it makes perfect sense. I mean, to her, not so much, but I mean, she'll get over it. She'll get over it probably. Oh, Marcus, good, good point. Yes, points gone. Easy to rip packs. No more points. And, I mean, I would look... I would even be willing to look at, like, a... Uh, you know, like a numbers deal on what it would cost to have nothing but uh, on-card autographs for stuff. I mean, it would it'd probably, like, be a, a small fortune... To get it, to uh, you know, get it, get it there. So I mean, I'm not gonna go that far, but I mean, let's say like maybe like some higher end kind of products, you know, like a National Treasures, no stickers, an NT, easy to rip packs, no points, no stickers, an NT. That is uh, that is what I will do as owner of Panini. A Chicago Bulls, Tony Kukoc. Nice. I mean, it makes perfect sense to me. It makes perfect sense. Alright, let's finish this up. I mean, if I don't do that, a uh, Markeef Morris to 99, then, uh, then you'll basically just never see me again. Chicago Bulls, BJ Armstrong. Look at that. An odd bit of autographs so far in this. A Ku coach and an Armstrong? That was weird. That was weird, 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 weird. This one is not super exciting. A Bernard King for the Knicks. Glorified signatures to 49. If you were looking for that Bernard King Knicks uh, owner, congratulations. You have got it. So how has the how has the beginning of the NBA season been? Any rookies uh, doing anything uh, anything fancy? A Mo and Alonzo mourning for the Heat. That's relatively fancy. I don't like Mo because he dipped after he dipped the Heat after he got all fixed up after his. Uh, health situation as best I remember And a Tyrone Wallace to 99. Destin, greatness for the Clippers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Andrew, I was not 100% sure. I was not 100% sure. 
because, you know, like, I mean, I hated Bo Jackson for years, for years, for what he supposedly did to the, uh, to the Bucks, only to, uh, after having, like, internet available to me, learn that, uh, you know, that the Buccaneers were the ones that, uh, were dicks to him, and that's, you know, why he was not going to sign with us. But to properly remember the Zoe, that uh, makes me a little happy. Hey, uh, Chris Dunn in 99. Ray John Rondo to 99. I'll give you $201 right now. If you can wait until next month to get paid. How's that how's that sound? For whatever for whatever you're talking about. Uh, Stanley Johnson to uh, 99. Hey, Edmund Sumner to 35 for the Pacers. Dude, the dude is wearing a bow tie. So you know for a fact he is legit. No, I mean, listen, I don't, I mean, I don't really care about the Heat. I mean, the Magic were my original team. But it just, it kind of sounds like he did the Heat. I always felt like, and again, I, I don't know, I don't necessarily know all the exact details but I felt like he did the, the Heat dirty. Like, Heat stuck with him while he was having, like, his his uh, medical situation. Once he, got, once he got all fixed up, he dipped. Is how, is how I understood the situation. Could be wrong. Probably wrong. But that was, like, the impression I got back in the day when there was not, you know, when I couldn't just Google it. Or if I could Google it, I didn't care enough to. Markel Fultz! Autograph. To 35. Nice card. Yeah, I don't know. I, I, I've never been a Lonzo Morning fan. I don't know what it is about him. I just I don't, I don't like him for some reason. To 99, uh, Jamal Murray. But, I mean, I am not a fan of most uh, players that are uh, not uh, completely invested in my team. In my team. But, yeah, that's what I, mean, that's what I thought. You got, you got, some, got some new kidneys and, uh, and dipped to, like, what, what was it, the Nets or something? It wasn't even a good team. I mean, like if he had bounced to the Lakers, you know, to get to get a to get a championship or something, you know, then I mean, I can then, then that I can kind of forgive. Because yeah, I mean, if I'd been in the league that many years, I'd I'd want I'd want a title too. But I feel like it was like some some crap squad that he just got paid for. I don't know. I'll look later now. Like I will, I will wake up at four o'clock in the morning and uh, have to pee. A hey, uh, Kadeem Allen, and uh, instead of uh, pissing standing up because I will be so tired, uh, it's forty nine uh, autograph for the uh, Celtics. I'll sit there on the toilet and I will somehow remember that I want to know why Alonzo Morning left the Heat. And uh, at uh, four o'clock in the morning, I will I will learn the truth. I guess as long as you learn the truth. <laughs> 
That's what's important, right? Some guy, Kevin Durant, claim to fame signatures. I think that's going to have to be Warriors. Pretty sure. I mean, I mean, 78 cents has got to be Warriors. I'm not, I, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not trusting anything here. Three unclaimed fame is going to go Warriors. I know that he did, Mark, but that doesn't always mean it. I mean, listen, to retire with somebody, whatever. That's, you know, I don't take, like, a lot of heed or, uh, you know, a lot of interest in that. And a Jordan Bell Warriors. All right. So autograph wise, we have got uh, a Durant claim to fame signatures for the Warriors. That uh, is the 49. A Kadeem Allen 49 for the Celtics. A uh, Markel Fultz uh, to 35 for the 76ers. A Sumner to 35 for the Pelicans. A Tyron Wallace to 99 for the Clippers. Alonzo Mourning uh, for the Heat. Vidar Kane to 49 for the Knickers. BJ Armstrong for the Bulls. A Tony Kukoc for the Bulls. A Milos for the uh, Clippers 49. Hart to 25 for the Lakers. And a uh, Ferguson for the Thunder to 99. Thank you, everybody, for this round, too. Yep.